pivoting hairline to create that perfect either money piece hairline or halo hairline. So I'm going to show you guys a breakdown of it right now. So as you saw, that was a tiny, tiny micro weave that I did. And that's going to be important for your very first few foils because that front hairline you want to blend and see those arrows see how i pushed it down you want to make sure you're pushing down and securing and then holding your fingers on each side of the foil and holding it up to keep it nice and secure and not slipping and as you can see right here my hand is supporting underneath the foil and right here i'm putting all of the hair up into that area so when i fold the foil I'm not gonna be creasing over that hair. So I like to push it all up so it lives together and it's gonna process more evenly for me that way. And I'm gonna work up doing baby light stitches right around the front hairline, lifting it all the way up the hair because the higher you lift the hair before you place the foil, the closer up you can get that foil really nice and tight to the scalp. Then I'm gonna go through and apply my lightener not right at the foil. See, when I first put down that lightener, I laid it down about a half inch away from the top. And then I'm gonna use the corner of my brush to really feather that lightener in. And now we're in warp speed doing teasy lights. So after I do back to back to back baby lights, I'm gonna go in and do teasy lights. And with these foils that you see me doing vertical, I do that because all that is virgin hair needed to be lightened and it will look much better. And you guys ready for the results? Look at that bright hairline. Let me know if you guys like this.